so start the piston off. Place the tool over the piston. Okay, that's nice and tight. Make sure it's flat as well. People may not agree with my method, but I'll be using just tissue extension. And the hammer, keep it flat to start tapping. a little bit more I think we have it so that's the second piston in also make sure it's pointing this way towards the engine there's an arrow on it so what I'll do now is I'll give the rest of the bores a good coating of um, transmission oil because transmission oil is a good lubricant and we'll then move to the bottom see you in a bit okay we're underneath the car huh. I've already done most of them or left the last one because I'm going to show you how to do this if you're in a tight space and the best way is Rotate the engine so it's on the last so it faces downwards. So if, so it's there at the bottom. And then ideally you want someone from the top just push the piston down um, if you haven't then you have to go back over the top which I'll do now so go back over the top push it to the bottom go back underneath and then you when you're back underneath you want to grab it with both hands and pull it down And finally you want to put your cap back on, make sure it's got some lube on it, engine oil, transmission oil will be okay, well the engine oil obviously will be okay, make sure it's facing the right way. It's not each time it's one handed but I'm going to try. Now, if I'm not mistaken, the jointing torque on these are 5 newton meters. That's the jointing torque. And then it's, I think it's something like um, 70 degrees extra or something like that after that. I'm not entirely sure. I'm going to have to go check my documentation. There we go. Finally getting somewhere with this machine. So I'm going to talk these up and then uh, we'll move on to the next stage. Okay, carrying on from the build. I'm going to put the head gasket on now. Basically I've given it all the wipe down, got rid of any oil, good spray or brake cleaner, it's all lovely and clean, the balls are lovely and clean. Got the head gasket and it just fits over two dowels. One here, one here. Uh, 
and next we'll get the uh, slender head on. It's not easy doing this on your own. Hmm. Yeah, we're on. So next, and I'll continue tomorrow on this, we're going to fit all the, all the bits and uh, pieces, rocker arms, lifters, Cams, um, and I'll get the. Uh, I still need to put the um, bottom conrod bolts in. Get those torqued up. And of course, get the cylinder head torqued down as well.